fence there. The Hellawick men had an early lead with a penalty goal conversion as they led 2 0. But the Vipers looked poised for the win and their determination paid off in the 10th minute with a great inside pass by Aceboas allowing Stagrat Amin to find space for the opener. And there goes the first try of the match going in the way of the Vipers. The Vipers stretched their lead further with another try by Shalom Bire in the 15th minute. He's over the line. What's the reference call? Try. The Wigmen came back in the 26th minute with a try to Gilmore Paul that left the scores at 12-6. Gilmore Paul has crashed over for the Wigmen. But 10 minutes before halftime, Brendan Gotuno managed to hold on to the ball for the Vipers' third try. Play on such a referee. And this is Gatuno, he's over for the Vipers. But it was the Wigman who scored before half time, closing the deficit to 18 points to 12 at half time. He should go over, and there it is. The second half had missed opportunities by both teams, but the Vipers managed to convert two penalty goals by Ase Boas, taking their lead to 20 points to 12. And it was Ase Boas who found good footing for himself to score the only try in the second half, closing off the match. 26 points to 12 in favor of the Vipers.